adding and subtracting money. Money vocabulary. Before we can begin adding and subtracting money, it's important to know the value and decimal for each coin and dollar amount. Here is a penny. The decimal amount is 0 0.01. Here's a nickel. Its decimal amount is 0 0.05, or 5 cents. Here's a dime. Its decimal amount is 0 0.10, or 10 cents. Here's a quarter. Its decimal amount is 0 0.25, or a quarter of a dollar. Here's a half dollar, or 50 cents. Its decimal amount is 0 0.50. This is a dollar. Its decimal point amount is 1.00, or one dollar. This is five dollars. Its decimal point is 5.00. And here's ten dollars. Its decimal point amount is 10.00. To add and subtract money, the amount must first be written as a decimal. The number of dollars will be written as the whole number to the left of the decimal. And the cents will be written as a fraction of a dollar to the right of the decimal point. For example, the following amount would be written as $5.35 or 5.35 because there is one $5 bill, one quarter, and one dime. As with any decimal addition or subtraction problem, the most important thing to remember is that the decimal points must be lined up. Adding the amount of $2.70 to our $5.35 would look like this. 5.35 plus 2.70 equals 8.05 or $8.05. Subtracting the amount would look like this. 5.35 minus 2.70 equals 2.65 or $2.65. Let's look at another problem. If we have $10 and purchase a stuffed animal for $4.50, how much money do we have left? Let's see. One zero point zero zero minus four point five zero equals five point five zero or five dollars and fifty cents. And there you have it. Adding and subtracting money is fun. Practice with the worksheets so you can become an expert in adding and subtracting money. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.